Hey everybody, I want to thank you for coming checking out our videos. We're back here in our uh, warehouse area, which we call Stacks. Uh, it's got all of our merchandise that is currently on eBay or Amazon or any other marketplace that we do business on. Um, what I'm going to do now is just go ahead and pull the merchandise that we have to ship today, show you how we do that, and uh, we'll go from there. We've got a computer right here. Um, I use a program called 6-Bit Software to do all my listings, shipping, everything. Um, but it pulls up what I've got to get out. I've already got some of the stuff already pulled and onto my cart. A couple things I need to pull. Dangerfield oil field sign. Got the sign, got it pulled. Um, Barbie doll. White background. It's pulled. Drag racing book. Got it pulled. And what else? Gloves. Black gloves. I think that's everything we've got to pull. Now I'll take you into our package area where we package all this up to get it out to our customers. All right, guys, now we're in our packaging area. This is where we do all of our packaging. Uh, you saw us pull the merchandise. Now it comes over here to where we actually package it up, put a label on it, and stick it in the mail. But uh, we've got all your supplies that you're going to need right here in one convenient location. That's important. You don't want to be going running all over your shop or your house looking for supplies. You want it all in, in one spot. Uh, our uh, warehouse area where we store all the uh, all the stuff we've already got listed on eBay is right over here in a room to our right and then this is where we just do our packaging. As you can see we've got a good organizational system, we've got all of our boxes, bubble mailers, um, peanuts, all that kind of stuff right here easy to get at. Uh, got our tape measure, got a a uh, razor blade, a pen, our scale, a uh, tape gun, and then over here we've got some miscellaneous cardboard for odd shaped items that we might want to package up in a different way. Got all the stuff we need to package. Uh, talk a little bit about where we get our boxes and our supplies. Um, our boxes mostly we use from the United States Postal Service. Free, best way to go is uh, UP or USPS if you can uh, get free boxes, which is a big bonus. Uh, we've got all kinds of different sizes that we use on a daily basis. Then we've got our bubble mailers. We use a lot of bubble mailers for our smaller items that we ship out. We buy these at Sam's Club. They're the cheapest that we've found, um, even cheaper than Uline or anywhere else. So. We we buy all of our bubble mailers from uh, Sam's Club. We also buy our uh, bubble wrap from Sam's Club. That's the cheapest place we found. Uh, the big bag of packing peanuts, we pay $26 for that at uh, Uline. Uh, you can check it out online, uline.com, or if you live in a big uh, metropolitan area, they'll have one near you. Uh, Uline's about two and a half hours from where we're at, but uh, I get to Dallas about once a month, or my wife does. And uh, we fill up the SUV with packing peanuts and uh, cardboard boxes that we also buy from Uline. Uh, another thing that we use a lot of are these uh, plastic Mylar mailers. Ship clothes in these. Uh, a lot of stuff that I put inside these mailers, uh, these uh, boxes, that maybe the box I don't want to get wear or something like that, I'll slide it into one of these. They're like 10 cents a piece, so they're super cheap. Uh, easy to use, but uh, this is how we do our packaging area. Uh, pretty simple, pretty self-explanatory. You know, you take your item, tape up your box, 
get your peanuts, tape it up, weigh it, write the measurements on it, and then we go over to the desk area and print out our labels. It's pretty simple, pretty self-explanatory, but uh, I kind of just want to show you how we do it. You can't reinvent the wheel on shipping. Um, process is real important to me. That's how we make our money. If we can do 200 listings in a, in a day where our competitors can only do 100 listings a day, then we're obviously a uh, step up on them. So uh, the next couple of videos will be more on that process and how we speed up that process. But uh, I'll also show you how we use uh, eBay's integrated shipping to print our labels, and I'll do that right now. All right, guys, now we've packaged our item. We've pulled it off the stacks, and we're ready to ship it out to our customer. So we go into our eBay. Uh, we use uh, Selling Manager Pro. Most of you guys, I would think, would have this. I'm not sure, but uh, this is how we do it. And so we go to Selling Manager Pro, items awaiting shipment. Pull that information up, and it's got all the stuff that we need to ship today. We ship the same day, or uh, in one day shipping. So these are all the items that we sold yesterday, um, or were paid for yesterday. Some of them sold, looks like, on the 13th, and were finally paid for yesterday. But uh, So we go in here, we go to print our shipping label. And as it pulls, and this is the screen we come to uh, for our information. It's got uh, what we have to ship. So we put in our weight. This weighed seven bounces. It calculates it. We hit printer postage label when we're ready and it'll print the label and we ship it out and pretty simple pretty easy you don't have to worry about the uh, confirmation or anything like that it does it automatically um, so we're real that's how we do it through eBay uh, another way another thing I wanted to show you guys too is also what I was looking at when I was pulling the orders this is our uh, shipping software or not shipping software but our listing software that we use here in-house and it uh, shows a good picture of everything that we need to pull so it's real easy to pull the items um, as you can see here these are the items that we needed to ship out today uh, shout out to how or Kraus house of cards uh, for this scenic game I saw it at a local thrift store I paid four bucks for it sold it uh, within a couple of days for forty nine ninety five so that worked out well but uh, the rest of this stuff is just stuff that uh, we've got along the way and uh, we go into our stacks and pull our orders put them on the cart take them to our shipping area and then you saw the rest of the process but uh, again guys I wanted to thank you for uh, taking time out of your day to listen to our video I try to make it as quick as possible this is really like I said not reinventing the wheel it's a pretty simple process and uh, you guys all have different ideas and I'd love to hear from uh, things we could change to maybe speed up our process if you got any ideas out there but uh, if you like what you saw and uh, you want to please leave a comment or like this video and I'll try to get some more out um, the rest of the week's pretty busy for me a lot of estate sales stuff going on so I don't think I'll get any more videos out this week but uh, hopefully this will carry over until next week I appreciate it guys and I'll see you next time